Hey guys, what's going on? It is Hiruga back here with another update video, right? <laughs> it has been a long time since I've recorded any kind of videos. So um, before anything, let me preface this by saying there's going to be swearing because that's just who I am. I swear. So just want to give a fair content warning. Um, but today, what we're going to be talking about, guys, is why I have been gone for so long. Um, and uh, I have a couple other things I want to address in this video, too. And I'm going to try to do it as quick as possible. But at the same time, <laughs> I've already recorded this video like two or three times. And I can never get it to be where I want it to be. So at this point, I'm like, you know what? I'm just going to I'm just gonna say what I need to say and then just end the video, okay? Um, and I, I tried recording it like last week and then some stuff came up. So I didn't get to finish it. So um, let's go ahead and start back at uh, the end of December 2022. So I made those two corruption videos that blew up my Hidoruga channel. I'm at like 35,000 subs now. Thank you guys so much. And um, that, uh, But they didn't blow up right away. They, it took them an entire year for those videos to blow up. So I posted them. And then right after I made those two corruption videos, I was like, you know what? I'm kind of feeling down. The channel's not growing as fast as I wanted to. I'm like a little burnt out, to be honest, by animation. So I'm going to take a bit of a break. And uh, then we go into uh, January 2023, so that was like two weeks later, and um, it was busy season at my job. I'm going to be kind of like vague as I get older. I'm like more vague about where I work and the stuff I do, but if you go through my older videos, you you can probably find out. But anyways, um, it was busy season at my job, so I didn't have any chance to make any videos for about four months. So then by the end of April... Um, I wanted to go get a field certification in my job field that would uh, let me get paid more money and also gives me better job opportunities. So I was like, all right, um, I'm done with master school now, but I need to go ahead and get the certification so I can get paid more, just get out of the way, and then I can have forever. So you, you basically need to complete master school in order to take it, uh, take the exam. So I was like, let me just get that out of the way. So um, I went ahead and took the exam and it's a multi-part exam and it basically took me five months. I did not uh, get my final score until midway into October. So the whole process took like five months. So um, that was another thing that took a lot of time. And I was not editing any videos. As it basically, here's what my schedule looked like from uh, May to October. Wake up, study, go to the gym, go to work, come home, study a little bit, go to bed. It was like that seven days a week. Um, like after the night after one of the exams or every exam, I would take like a little break, but that's the only time I'd like slacked off my studies. Um, so I'm like, maybe for those entire five months, I had like one full 24 hour break. <laughs> it's crazy when you think about it, but that's, that's how my, my, my life was. And then, uh, so then, uh, so that was the second big thing, right? So first it was busy season. Then I went to go get my field certification. And I did pass, by the way. I passed all the exams first try, no problems. Um, and by the way, that exam has like a 50% fail rate. So I, I'm, I'm pretty happy about that. I'm not going to lie. So um, then the next big thing was, well, in case you guys don't know, going to college isn't free. So I was like, all right, uh, let me go ahead and get two more jobs in addition to what I'm working already. Um, and so I can get enough money to pay off this loan. It's not that my job didn't pay me well. Um, cause I, I was working through this entire process, right? It's not that my current job doesn't pay me well. It's that I wanted to pay it off as quick as possible. Um, so if I just got two shitty jobs, um, in addition to my current job, I would be able to pay it off really quick. And that's exactly what happened. So by the end of December, I got that, uh, school loan paid off. So now I'm no longer into debt to anyone. And I'm very happy about that. Um, and that's the entirety of 2023 for me. So basically it was a busy season, go get my field certification and then pay off my loan. That entire 12 months, I was basically working s seven days a week. That's exactly how that last year went. So then we go into 2024. You guys notice I say it's busy season of the year, right? So now I have to deal with, uh, the busy season at my job again, as soon as it hits January, uh, 24. And I did have a few weeks before it got really busy, which is why you guys saw me upload a few videos, but I only had like those three weeks to get videos done. So uh, then I go through the busy season again, working like 70, 80 hours a week. 
And then we finally make it to the uh, towards the end of April, which is where we're at now. It's April 23rd, the day I'm recording this. So we're all we're all done. Everything is done. I have my field certification. The busy season is done. I have tons of vacation time stored up from my job. And uh, I'm not a debt to anyone. So basically what that means is this is going to be the first year where I don't have any restrictions to my uploading. I think the only year I could compare this to is like 2021 which is like when I first started YouTube again, um, when I wanted to come back and finish my Fates Let's Play. And at that time, I didn't have um, a lot of obligations either. But then, like, for those two or three years from then until now, I did start getting more obligations. But now, I'm finally free again. My animation skill has increased a lot since I first started. You guys go to, like, the Hidoruga TV. Oh, wait, that's this channel. <laughs> you guys go to, like, some of my older videos. You'll see, like, the shitty animations are on here, the ones that I don't like a lot. Um, and then go to Hidoruga, my main channel. Definitely improved over the last three years. So that's basically the reason why I was gone for an entire year and a half. Um, those four main things. Busy season, get my field certification, pay off my loans, and then busy season again. So now I'm back for the next like eight months or so, eight or nine months. So, um, and let me tell you guys something too. I actually did plan to leave YouTube back in December of 2023 before those two corruption videos blew, blew up. And here's why. Because the, one of the reasons I had that little like, I wouldn't call it a depression, but like, I was kind of turned off by animation back in December 2022 is because my channel wasn't like doing well. I had a couple thousand subscribers and like one of my videos had like had, like 50k plus views or something like that. Hold on. <laughs> Excuse me. Sorry about that. <clears throat> Anyways, um, the reason I got into that like little sad slump there is because my, my channel wasn't get like growing and I was putting all this time I'm sitting in front of my computer for hours on end animating these videos and I did have a bit of success on TikTok I got like 30k followers um or no it's like 20k I don't remember anyways <laughs> um but I, on YouTube YouTube has always been my baby I was not getting the return I wanted for all the time I was putting in so I was like we have to go find something I can do in addition to my job on the side that can make me money because that's kind of the goal with YouTube for me is to make money off of it. Um, and I don't want to like make it my living. That's never been the goal to make it my living. I just want, if I'm going to be putting hours on the computer, I kind of want it to be doing something for me, which is, you know, making me money. So once those videos blew up an entire fucking year later, then I was like, hold on, we might have the opportunity to actually make this into a business. So instead of like throwing the YouTube channel away, that I've had since I was like 14 years old, why don't we go ahead and try to uh, make something out of it? Because now I have the opportunity to. So I didn't get full monetization, but those two videos blew blowing up in addition to all my other views on my channel, uh, let me get like a channel membership and people can directly donate to my YouTube, which is cool. I don't really want that though. My goal is to like have ads run on my videos and then I get money from that. Um, so that's kind of, you know, my goal with the channel. In order to do that, I need 4,000 watch hours for an entire year or 10 million views for 90 days. I don't think I'm going to be able to get that many views in 90 days because um, I would need like 10 corruption videos to blow up all at the same time. It's, it's just that that's not my channel. My channel can, won't be able to do something like that. I don't post frequently enough. It takes like an entire weekend, like three day weekend for me to finish those videos. Um like the animations I do. So that's just that's just like off the table. So I'm like, my best bet is to do those 4,000 watch hours, but I might not even really try to get that goal this year. I just kind of want to put out some shorts that I've had on my notepad for years and get those uh, pumped out. And then maybe 2025, we can focus on long form content and trying to get that 4,000 watch hours. So um, yeah. And another thing too is, um, you know, there are videos I've had on my notepad for years that I want to get out. Like I have a Sonic video I had in my head that I thought of back like in four year university. And I never even made that video just not because I didn't want to just I never found the right time to make it. But I still intend on making it one day just, um, you know, I haven't had it, the time wasn't right to make it. So, you know, two reasons I'm returning is because the channel has the opportunity to be monetized. And I also want to finish all the ideas on my notepad. That's important to me. 
Um, so what's next directly for the channel? Well, I'm going to finish this Dark Sonic vs. Uh, Majin Vegeta video that I started. An an annoying thing for me is that I don't like editing videos that I started and then I had to leave and now I have to come back and finish him. It's like a very big turnoff to me. I, I don't I don't like doing that. I'd rather just like start fresh if I haven't been here in a while. But I do want to finish the video since I started it a little bit before the busy season. So that video needs to get done. So that's coming out regardless. And then the next videos after that, I'm going to give the people what they want. I'm going to finish Corruption of uh, the series. I'm going to do two more uh, battles. And then I'm going to do a compilation episode like I did with Pico and Hank. And then I'm going to do um, a Mammy mini series, which <laughs> I referenced like 1 to 1.5 years ago. <laughs> and it has like three episodes in it or something. And then I'm going to compile that and finish it. And then I will have some more FNF fights planned, but they're going to be uh, one-off videos. No more like full like length series, like part one, part two. Like not, no more of that. It's just going to be one-off battles. So, um, and I'm also going to be doing some uh, anime fights. And, um, like, anime uh, sprite battles and, like, Sonic sprite battles throughout the rest of the year as well. Um, so it's basically the rest of the year after I finish those two series is going to be, like, FNF fight, then sprite fight, and then anime fight. Or something like that. Um, every month. So, uh, yeah, and then I said, yeah, the long... I, I have a list I'm reading off of. That's why it, like, sounds like I'm kind of going down like a bulletin. But yeah, the long format videos, I do have videos planned, but that'll be probably 2025 if I keep doing YouTube by then. Um, so that's what's going on with Hidoruga, right? So then, what's going on with Hidoruga TV? I don't have too much planned with this channel. Um, me and Connor, the guy who's been on my Doki streams, and I think him and I record FNF. Um, he's going to be on a Pokemon video with me. We're actually recording it tomorrow, so it will get done. I'm not going to edit that video like I did the first one, but... Uh, we are going to record it, just kind of fuck around on Showdown, and I think that'll be entertaining um, for you guys to watch, or at least me, I, I know, I like making those videos, um, and then also I want to do a live stream with uh, me, Connor, and Lamb, the guys who I recorded Doki Club with, and we're going to record um, another game, but I don't want to reveal it, um, it's just, we're just, well, we're not even recording, we're live streaming it, um, and I think that'll be entertaining for you guys as well. Um, and at some point in the future, I don't know when, that was really loud, sorry. Um, I want to record Doki Club mods with Connor and Lamb. Um, that all started back then, like, when we were all, like, had a bit more free time in our schedules. But, um, you know, their lives have vastly changed since when we recorded that. And so was mine. So, um, we, we probably could make it work if I wanted to, but I'm kind of lazy about it. It's not, it's not on top of my priority list, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> so... Um, that's what's going on in Hiroruga TV. And then Chain Body, I am going to finish the Last Promise, uh, that Fire Emblem Let's Play. Um, I don't even remember what chapter I'm on. I'm, I just know Ed Water was a fucking god, or at least I guess I'm up to be. Um, Lamb and I are going to be finishing Engage. Him and I are going to be recording every week. Um, so there will be at least one video a week, unless he's busy, or I'm super busy. I shouldn't be as busy as he is. Because, um, like I told you guys, my schedule's been freed up. So him and I are going to finish that. Um, and then overall, like, what's the goal of the channel, right? The goal, like I said, is to monetize it. Um, and it's, it's not even, like, about 100% money. It's just, like, when you guys get older, you have to realize if you're going to put so much time into something, it needs to be doing something for you, right? Like, the reason I like going to the gym so much, I'm building up my body and sculpting up the physique I want. So I don't mind going to the gym every day. And put in those hours to get the body I want. So, but it's got to be the same thing with like my pastimes. Like I don't really like playing video games that much for the same reason. Like I, I'll play a video game with my friend and record it, but like video games on my free time, that's like something I very seldom do because I just don't think it's that good of a use of my time anymore. So that's why you know animation on YouTube is like I think a, if I can monetize it, it'd be a good idea because you're doing something you like making the videos that you always, you know, wanted to, and you're getting a bit of money off of it. So, um, that's kind of the goal of the channel, right? And, um, yeah, like I said, YouTube will never be a primary income source, um, and I don't want it to be, even if I had a b billion subscribers, I'm okay with having my uh, real-world job. So, I'm not saying, like, 
people who do YouTube are like idiots or whatever. I'm just, it's not for me. So, um, I think that's everything I wanted to say in the video. I'm looking at my list and I'm, I'm not missing anything. So, uh, this week, the week of the 23rd, whatever that is, um, I'm going to have way more time and I will get that Sonic video done. I need the right motivation to finish it. Like I said, I hate starting old work, but it needs to get done. Um, and then we're going to be doing uh, Corruption Part 2, if you want to call it that. <laughs> and then that Mammy series, and from then on out, you guys are going to get a lot of cool one-off battles for the rest of the year. Hope you guys are excited to see the content I bring. Um, I am excited. I'm, I'm, I, at this point, I'm mostly just like excited to start new work. I, I don't want to. I don't want to like do any old stuff. <laughs> I just got. That's why I got to finish these fucking FNF corruption, mammy, and like this Dark Sonic video. Just finish that shit already. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe. I'm happy to be back after my year and a half hiatus. Leveled up in the real world. Um, and hopefully I can bring you guys some enjoyable content in the future. Y'all have a good one. Thanks for watching.